What is up, people geeps? Hey, tonight I am making dinner. I see a little keister coming. Hi. Here's keister. So tonight I'm making dinner and dinner is going to be chicken soup. Technically chicken noodle soup, but it's like, it's made with couscous. So, <laughs> and then fruit salad with honey yogurt lemon dressing on the side and then bread there's our dinner oh and last night i made creme brulee which i didn't vlog because i'm pretty sure i vlogged it before and i'm making this today but i didn't do the sugar yet so i'm waiting to do the sugar so that's dinner and i'll i'll show you me making dinner <laughs> it's 3 14 so it's still pretty early in the day there's a lot of prep work to do for this so i'm gonna do that right now i'm trying to like pull my hood through my apron look at that oh, that feels more comfy that's better probably looks a little weirder but it's all good first start with the fruit salad so in the fruit salad i'm gonna have an apple some oranges some peaches some bananas and some strawberries and so that's for the fruit salad i don't know how much of everything i'm gonna need yet so i'm not going off of a recipe for this we'll see i'm just gonna kind of chop them up and then i'll be like that looks good or that needs a little bit more and then for the soup i also have to cut up some stuff for the soup so carrots it said two large carrots but we already had baby carrots so i'm just cutting up some of those one yellow onion i think it was a tablespoon of ginger it also called for turmeric but that's expensive so didn't do that and then and then two stalks of celery and then it also called for some garlic and i found this in the fridge and i don't know if my mom got it for the soup or if this isn't ours or if it's for something else i don't know so i'm gonna wait to do this until my mom texts me back so yeah i'm just doing some little choppy choppy dicey dicey right now and then i'll actually get to the actual cooking part later yeah look who came to join me hello there puppy hi how are you doing on this fine evening hmm come here hi hello there oh and then she runs away okay Look at my eyeballs. Look at those, look. I bet you can't guess what I was just cutting. I was just cutting the onions. It really hurts. <laughs> okay, so all of the prep is done. I have all of the things grated, sliced, minced, diced, whatever. So now I am just waiting until like five or so. So like half an hour, 40 minutes to get the actual dinner going and then I'll make the dinner and do the things all right it has been about hour 45 minutes since the last time i have talked to you guys it's time to start actually cooking now so like i said prep is over so now we're actually going to be cooking so to do the soup you need a tablespoon of oil it said avocado or olive oil and we don't have avocado oil so olive oil it is so just a tablespoon of that in the bottom of a probably the largest pot that you have once the oil is hot you add all the yummy veggies and stuff all of the veggies that i prepped earlier except for the ginger so i gotta change the battery because it's gonna die okay i'm on my phone now because something's wrong with the battery camera and i don't know what's going on anyways as i was saying so now the oil's nice and hot in there Actually, I should take the spatula off because the spatula is hot. And so then you're just going to add all of that good. Oh my goodness. Okay, give me a minute. Hold on. Hold on. That was more extreme than I thought it was going to be. Oh man. It's getting real now, folks. 
turn that down. Okay, so now, oh, my hand's covering it. Now we're just gonna let that go. Let all of those cook up all nice. It said until the onions are translucent. That's gonna be once they're all like cooked through and yummy and all that jazz, you know what I mean? You can see High School Musical back there. Great movie. Okie dokie, so the things are translucent. The onions are translucent. So now we're gonna add one pound of chicken, six cups of low sodium chicken broth, some thyme. The thing calls for rosemary, but I can't find any. I'm kind of thinking I might just do some Italian seasoning instead. Some pepper and then the grated ginger. And then you just mix it all up in there until the chicken's cooked. Okay, so here it is in the pot. You can see the chicken is in there, which is a little funky, but that's what the recipe says to do, so. And so then we're just gonna let that boil, and then I'll show you what to do after it boils. Guys, good news. Shad hacked the camera, and now I can use it again. So we're back to camera life. That's nice. So anyway, it's still going. It's not boiled yet. Okie dokie. So it's time for the next step. I got rid of my little thingy that holds the camera. So you're gonna come right here. So it's boiling actually pretty pretty big old time -o. So now we're gonna add couscous. I don't know if I'm saying that right. I've never had it before even. We're just gonna add that in. And then it says to cover it for like 25, 30 minutes, I think the recipe says. I can't open the package. I'm gonna add that in. Okay, so while the chicken is cooking and it's simmering on the stove, which I just smelled it and it smells really good. Ooh, that's a loud window. It smells really good. I'm kind of excited. While that's doing that, if I can open the yogurt, I'll make the dressing for the fruit salad and I'll show you guys. This, I'm kind of just making it up because I've made it once before and it was really good. And I feel like, or I couldn't find another recipe, first of all. Second of all, it's also just seems really simple. So there we go. Got the yogurt open. I totally just spilled yogurt. So I asked my mom just to get some plain yogurt so it's not like flavored or sweetened or anything like that. It's just yogurt, just plain, kind of gross tasting yogurt. Yeah. I don't like plain yogurt. It'll taste better though. Then we're gonna add some lemon, some lemon juice, just a touch. And then my favorite part, honey. This part makes it taste good. Yummy. Okay. And then you just kind of mix it up in the bowl. And then keep adding stuff until I think it tastes good. It'll just be like something for us to put on the side with our fruit. Then we could like, I'm gonna dip this strawberry in the yogurt. That's what we're gonna do. I was gonna show you guys, see if I had any cool socks on today, but they're just those. Okay, so I just started the bread while that was done and then the chicken is done now, so now I'm just shredding it in this little thingy. And then I'm just gonna plop it back in the soup and then the soup's done. And then we'll just like wait until my mom gets home. When she gets home, I'll put the bread in the oven. And then once the bread's done, we're ready to eat. Yay! It's done. So we got our bread. We got our soup. And we got the fruit salad and the dressing. I think this is gonna be yummy. I'm pretty excited to eat it. I'm hungry. I hope everyone else is hungry. Mm-hmm, super. Mom got home. Yeah, I just got home from work and I walked in the door and it smelled so good. Just like a home cooked meal. I mean, this is why I need my own chef. <laughs> so I don't have to cook and I can just work and take care of my kids and come home to dinner. You wanna do this every night? I don't know about every night. <laughs> All right, and Carson, while well, we're gonna eat yummy soup, Carson is eating his green beans. First time he's had green beans and it's so yummy. Do you love it? Huh? We're like documenting every new food that you eat because it's so much fun. You're my last baby, so we gotta document it all. Teddy can make you some green beans. I said I was gonna make Carson's baby food, but I don't have time, I don't have time for that. So there's a reason, yeah, there's a reason why God invented people to make baby food. Mmm. The yogurt thing with the fruit, pop nut. Really? Okay. Oh, I'm just gonna throw it right on top of there. There you go. 
Okay, Shad, when you're ready for your first bite of soup, let me know so we can document it. Okay, when do that, Keaton will oh. show that first. Okay, so Keaton has really big, huge news. Do you want to tell him what it is, Keaton? You want me to tell him? Oh, your mouth is full. All right, so about a month ago, Keaton sent some mail. She, she drew a picture, right? And wrote on it and sent a piece of mail to Stephen Scherer. Is that his YouTube channel name? Okay, yeah, so it's Stephen Scherer. She sent some mail to him. Today, she got a postcard back from him. Oh my gosh, she got some. I don't know, a response to her fan mail, I guess. It says her name on there, like it's literally addressed to Keaton Logue. What does it say on there, Keaton, for you to like sing along to his new music video and then post it on Instagram and tag him, yeah, right? Yeah, it says, do you love to sing along? Do you love to what? Uh, do you love to sing along? Sing along, okay. Keaton's actually already been practicing and we're gonna do a little video and post it on Instagram and tag Steven Sharer. Were you so excited, like shocked when you got that in the mail? <laughs> I think that's a yes. You're a little bit shy, huh? <laughs> and, and he, if, if you don't know who Steven Scherer is, they're like, there's a bunch of them in the family that do YouTube. He has like 9 million subscribers, so <laughs> he's a little bit bigger than us. Um, a little. A <laughs> little. No, bad, bad. Way bigger. Yeah, I know. I was teasing, but that's pretty cool. I'm going to taste the soup. We've got some carrots, <clears throat> couscous, some chicken, celery. Apparently, it's hot. That's a bang up soup right there. Good That's job. Good job. Yeah. Really good. Okay, my turn to try the soup. I'm super excited because <laughs> it, it smells delicious. Super, super excited. Yep. Yeah. Okay, I got an onion and a carrot in the Couscous. Oh, there's a little bit of chicken too. Okay. Oh, that's hot. Hang on. Couscous. Mmm. It's really good. The flavor is really good. I thought I've had couscous before, but maybe I haven't. I don't know. It's really good. Thank you, Kennedy. You're welcome. Everyone, the time is here. We finished dinner. We all determined it was pretty good. And now I'm gonna sugar the crème brûlées that I made yesterday. So I made five of them. Uh, we're just eating two of them tonight. I'm gonna sugar all of them so that way it's like quicker to just like snatch it out of the fridge and go nom 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 nom. I'm gonna sprinkle. I'll show you guys this process. I'm gonna take a spoonful. It said a tablespoon and one teaspoon, but both of those are dirty. So, and then you just sprinkle it on top like so. And then you go a little shaky, 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 just to get it nice and coated. Like so, and then, <laughs> this is the fun part. Prepare yourselves, guys. Okay, let's get these ones out of the way. Okay, then my blowtorch. We're gonna put it like here. Oh, it's not working. Oh, there it is, I figured it out, okay. So then, it's doing it. It's doing it, guys. There you have it. It smells really good in here right now. Okay, so I'm gonna do that to all of them. Once you're done, ooh, it's really hot. The bottom's cold though. So now I just let that sit until it gets hard, and then we get to eat these. I'm excited. I haven't made creme brulee with the blowtorch before. <laughs> it's a lot of fun. I'm excited. <laughs> Are you more excited about this or the soup? Okay, ready? So, well wait, I mean you've been You've made this once before, but you had to toast the sugar in the oven because right. we didn't have the butane for the right. flamer thing. Uh -huh. So now you actually got to do it the right way. Yeah. Ready? Okay, crack yours. 
<laughs> Look how beautiful that Ooh. is. Can you want to crack mine? Yay! Oh, this looks Okay, hang on. Don't do it yet, Keaton. Look, Kennedy, try it. Mm. How do you crack mm -hmm. it? It's like, is it good? That's it. Mm. I'm in love. It's so good. I think I did try it the last time because it just tastes like vanilla pudding or something, right? Pretty much. It's custard. So Keaton's going to crack use, use the, yeah. Shad's. There you go. Ooh. Mm -hmm. There it goes. See, it should have been in a bunch of different little pieces on the top. Yep. Oh, there they are. Okay, perfect. Perfect. Yeah. Can I have my back? Please. I love this. I, yeah. Mm hmm. We don't have any more little spoons, so. Yeah, we got spoon. the big spoons. <laughs> You're missing out, for real. Mm -hmm. Is there a crust in there, or it's just the custard? Just the custard. Just custard. Okay. With the sugar. crust on top. <laughs> yeah, it's like a, a thin glass layer. <laughs> You're like, yes! I've been this is awesome. for this. It's so good. Really? I've, surprisingly, though, I've never had creme brulee at a restaurant. Only Didn't you have it on the cruise? Because mm -mm, I was like, I chickened out. Oh. Only times I've had creme brulee is when I made it. Mm -hmm. What did you have on the cruise? Mm, like chocolate cake. Kennedy oh. and Josiah and my mom both got creme brulee, or all three, and then we. Shad and myself and my dad got this lava cake. How's your creme brulee? Thanks for watching Bob's Life. You should make Kitty soup, everybody.